Hello, Arrow here uh, from Shadow Bear and Arrow. Um, this is part two of uh, our altar uh, series, um, and and Carrie here is with us today. I don't know if you can see her, but she's she's joining the uh, the fun. But this is part two. Uh, you saw um, uh, Shadow Bear's altar and how he set his up. And actually, okay, this is my altar here, and I got this piece in my early twenties, so I've had it about over 40 years I've had a long time but um, we set it up I unbeknownst to either one of us we kind of set ours up very similar so um, I have as you can see up on top all of my my um, allies and and protectors and and uh, uh, the wolf is very important in my actually in my family so I have a, a coyotes and wolves and, and that sort of thing uh, uh, and it's very important to my family. Uh, a lot of us have wolves. I don't know, for some reason we gravitate towards them. Uh, so anyway, that's the top. And uh, these most of the stuff that I have um, were either I, found, I came across them, and that's how all of, I think all of our altars are, are um, put together. You just find things that, you, that mean something, that, uh, that speak to you, and those are the things that you keep, and you put them in your altar. You, you display them in your altar. So mine is set up, this is uh, each season, so spring, summer, fall, i open this one up fall and and uh winter down here so um and this is like this this here this plate here was uh my great grandmother's um these everything that came in with the family or i found them or somebody gave them to me and they just spoke to me and i put them in my altar so a friend of mine every year at christmas time or at the during the holidays at yule um sends me these origami uh this is a butterfly. I have a swan here, but in each season she sends me one. So uh, I have actually mostly each season has a, a some sort of an origami gami or, ornament. This is my summer, and I have my. This is uh, Ma Rainey and Willie Dixon. Um, they just mean summer to me for some reason. They they speak to me as summer. I'm, a friend of mine sent me those postcards and a long time ago, and I just put them in there, and that's where they ended ended up. This is my dad's, uh, uh, when he was in the uh, Army, World War II, he was an MP. He goes in here. I put him right in the middle here. And then I even had feathers, uh, this little bottle. I have a lot of little containers. Some have stuff in them, some don't. This one does not. But I do have others that do. Um, this little mermaid here that I found at a, um, on a trip one time uh, at an antique store. A lot of feathers. Feathers are gifts. So if you find one, you see one, you, you know, we all know we have to pick them up and, and keep them. Uh, either give them away or keep them in your, in your altar. And then uh, all these little things, a lot of cats, little, my little um, palm. I have here with all the you know the lines on here so that's that's spring and summer and then all of these pieces here again this is made out of coal this is a woman from the the probably the Appalachian Appalachian Mart mountains um, and um, she's precious she's just she's a strong woman and that's, uh, as you can see, this is more of a woman's altar because uh, most of the figures here are uh, of women. I have photos of my ancestors there in my little log book here. But I, had, I got two out just to show you. Um, this is my, <clears throat> my grandma, Daisy, and I'm so, what's his last? I don't know, my <laughs> Lewis, okay. <laughs> I, know my, I know Daisy. I never met uh, grandpa, great grandpa. Lewis, so that forgive me for not knowing his name, but that's his name. But I did meet Daisy so many times. Well, several times. I would, I think I was maybe eight or nine when she passed. But this is her on her wedding day. This is their wedding picture, and then this is them many years later. Mm. They've lived a good hard life, a good long hard life. 
So, okay, so that's, those are some of my ancestors. I was just going to show you. This is my wand. Uh, this one I made from a branch in my old, at my old house. This is a corkscrew willow, and I cut the branch and um, let it dry out, and I sanded off this, the outer layer and um, uh, oiled it down with frankincense oil um, to make it. And every now and then I have to do that. It was a little longer, and the tip broke off. I guess it wasn't supposed to be as long as <laughs> I had made it. So, so, um, and then this is the fall. Uh, and then I, again, I have more feathers in here and my little bell for spells. Um, just some Halloween stuff because you got to have Halloween stuff in the fall. This is uh, from my, uh, one of our dogs, Artie, who passed away. And then I have Shirley. She was one of my, oh, she was my little, we were had a very strong connection. And again, you'll see here I have some more. Uh, this is the newest one that they made. This is a cardinal, the little um, origami. They just sent this. And then there's a Santa, and here's a Santa here. But you see, there's all, and these are um, ashes from uh, some pets, the first three pets that I ever had. Uh, white feather, it's a blessing, an angel, right? That's right. right. And then um, this is uh, my late husband's ashes here. I keep that there. And uh, so that's that's that. And then underneath, um, underneath here, it's a mess. I mean, it's not a mess. I know where everything is. But this is all of where my stuff is for my stash for spells. Um, I have condensers and oils. <clears throat> excuse me, spell condensers and oils. And then, um, you know, this is all stuff that I collected. My uncle grows these beautiful roses, so I collect all the rose petals. <clears throat> these are really, if I can get it open, yeah. These are really beautiful, dark, beautiful red roses that I dry them all. He brings them over when, he's, when they're done, and then I dry them out, collect them for spells. And I have, my cats give me stuff. They, these are their claws. I use those. And then I have whiskers somewhere. I don't know where they're, maybe right next to them. Oh, and I have a Robin's eggshell. I do have whiskers somewhere. I don't know where they are. They're in there somewhere. And down there are the oils. And then I keep my candles. And <clears throat> it has to share space with my mother's china. So it's just a big conglomerate. I know where everything is, but, but. If you look at it, it looks like a big mess, so. But it's not really. And then um, also, in here, um, I do clay work. This is some of the stuff that I've been working on. It's just some clay work that, uh, so I keep that kind of stuff in here for um, crafts, uh, hand crafting. And this is, and I have some voodoo dolls. Uh, I always collect, I never throw anything away, so I have ribbons and, and, uh, oh, just pieces of string and all that stuff. I don't, I keep it all, so. And then, um, this is where my incense is. Well, there's those glasses. I wonder where those were. Okay. All right. So, anyway, um, that's my altar. Um, I hope you found it interesting or uh, mildly entertaining. Uh, thank you for watching this. Uh, if you have uh, any comments or questions, please um, post them uh, on our site. And uh, if you like this, please like it, subscribe, and share.